What is good, peasants? My name is JB, and I am back here today with another Pokemon Unite video. And this time, we're going to be trying out the new Ninetales. But before we get into the build and my thoughts on Ninetales, I want to go ahead and ask you guys to go ahead and drop a follow on my Twitch. The link is in the description. Go ahead and go follow me over there. I'm going to be streaming BDSP release, going to be streaming Decidueye release as well. So definitely go uh, check us out over there. It means a lot to me. And follow me on TikTok as well. My TikTok's been popping off a little bit. And if you like, you know, watching my clips and stuff like that, it means a lot to me. Uh, you know getting a few more followers over there so drop a follow follow your boy drop a sub on the channel if you haven't already and like the video just do all the youtuber stuff just do all the things do all the stuff it'd be very cool of you now anyways as i was saying we're gonna be playing the new nine tails so i was a little bit hesitant to make a video about nine tails on the uh release of the patch just because i kind of figured that uh they messed something up with nine tails because they literally said they buffed it but they actually nerfed it and I was right, and I'm not so sure if they, you know, it was actually a bug like they claimed. I think they kind of just didn't buff it and wanted to say they buffed it. So then they actually went back and reverted it. So Ninetales does still get that um, power spike upon evolving at level four for previously actually lost attack at level four when it evolved. So uh, if you want to go see all the exact numbers, I'll leave Unite DB in the description. So you can go check out and read all the actual numbers and actually all the actual like math behind it for yourself. I don't understand it, but I do know Ninetales is actually good now. So uh, we're going to be trying out the also buffed Blizzard build. That was honestly my preferred build uh, even before the changes i i just I, I like that sort of play style that battlefield control play style i, I just really enjoy stuff like that obviously aurora veil is also really really good so honestly i just think nine tails is still very very solid and like just a decent pick it's just the lack of mobility just makes it so hard to play against the you know, top of the meta stuff like talonflame and Aurora, especially in solo queue when you run into those pokemon every game lucario even it's just really hard to play against like good characters but if you manage to get into a game with some less than great characters you can kind of just pop off and that's you know what nine tails excels at is just being a bully in lane and that it, my tells is one of the best pure laners if not the best pure laner in this game because a lot of stuff you know prefers jungle or is also can excel in the jungle i think from a pure laning standpoint nine tells might be the best pure laner in the game in terms of uh attack the adc pokemon attack damage carry yeah you guys get it. anyway uh the items we are rocking are going to be buddy barrier focus band and uh choice specs you can switch out uh focus for muscle band both are good on nine tells because it just drops a just constantly spamming it's auto attack so you can really use either band you can honestly switch it out for specs as well if you're playing the aurora veil build still but we're going to be rocking choice specs focus and buddy for this game and yeah that's really all there is to it i think nine is in a much much better place now it is very strong it's always been very strong but obviously it's just better now so let's just see how much better now it is without further ado let's go ahead and hop on into the gameplay okay we in the game got some people on our squad we got a we got a pretty pretty threatening squad not gonna lie oh we have a, we have a we have an absol though yikes yikes uh this is the last person to pick and uh kind, kind of ruin the whole team combo we'll make it do we'll make do they have a pretty squishy team as well so i'm hoping nine tails can actually put in some work they have a lot of close range stuff too so the village should actually be able to put in a decent amount of work i am pretty darn scared of that charizard though but we'll see if we can't do our thing. We are, of course, going to be rocking the buffed Blizzard and seeing if that uh, is all it's hyped up to be. I think it is. I think it's pretty big. I've always been a big fan of Ninetales. This has always been my preferred build on Ninetales, too. So, see, they got to be the last person to pick and also try to still jungle. Just uh, degenerate behavior. Absolute degeneracy. <laughs> Thankfully, he is at least kind of an adult and did not fully commit to stealing the jungle. So, you can appreciate that in a person, I guess. He didn't fully go full jerk face. I will steal this from you. It's mine. Thank you. Thank you for thank you for all your hard work. Ralts, really do appreciate it. Go away. No one likes you, no one needs you. This is mine now too. Appreciate your hard work, Bulbasaur. <laughs> but I shall reap the rewards of it and evolve. Honestly, that's G genuinely that is the correct uh play is for him to let me have that so yeah because now we're just absolutely dominant in lane so yeah um i've always been a big fan of this nine tails build i preferred it even when like it was bad like it, it, i just like the wall man i was a crustle player at the start of this game like i i i, I just like walls man may is one of my favorite players or characters to play in overwatch like bro, I, I just like i just like builds like this man i just like walls Maybe I shouldn't say that. Maybe, maybe I shouldn't phrase it that way, but I did, so who cares? Um, <laughs> I don't know. I'm just, just a big fan of the sort of like crowd control style of 
gameplay in any MOBA or I guess first person shooter if you want to count Overwatch. Um, but yeah, of course you, you know, count Overwatch as a first person shooter. You, you get what I'm saying. I, I, just, I just really like this play style. Like battlefield control, stuff like that. Even in like D&D, like I, I, I just like being able to control the battlefield, man. It's just fun. It's just fun to me. And we just absolutely obliterate that poor um, jungler Zara rotating in. Like I'm just, I can just bully these guys in lane, like, like in their zone. It's just, it's just fun. It's just fun, dude. It's just mean. Like if you land all of your attacks as this Nine Tails build, it's just disgusting. Like it's, it's, it's always been good, and it's just like the buffs made it better. Of course, that's what the buff does. Just push this guy into our zone. Yeah, you're done. What do you, what do you think, pal? You're still, you're still a Charmander. You just, you don't, you don't stand a chance. And like he's in lane with a Ralts too, so. I should have scored last, but eh. Not with, you know, a team obviously not coordinated enough to figure that out, so it's fine. We only overdone. I mean, yeah, yeah it's whatever. It's whatever. <clears throat> just want to make sure we get the most points in. Like, I had the biggest score there. I just want to make sure I got it in, because, like I said, not with the coordinated team. Just make sure I get my score in, you know. I got to get MVP too. Like, let's be real. I, I got to get MVP in, you know, keeping that, uh, keeping this, uh, Bulbasaur from, or Ivysaur from scoring helps me get MVP too, so. I think it's you know worth it in the end right <laughs> uh i am not at all worried about that charmander and like i said um you know talked about this quite a few times over my last few videos if i get if i get um first zone broken before rotom i'm taking rotom like it's just better like if they that absolute just absolutely destroyed my bottom lane like he just got a uh, triple kill which is disgusting so yeah well, i don't even think we'll be able to make it down. oh you want to all right <laughs> sure bud <laughs> how's it going sarah <laughs> thanks for coming you want some too? Oh, that's just mean. That's just mean, Ivysaur. That's just mean. Charmeleon's behind us. I think we can actually just push this in. I'm trying to wait for Rotom. I don't want to get jumped on. Actually, yeah, I, I, I didn't want exactly that to happen. I didn't want exactly that to happen. Damn. And now neither one of us scored. Yeah, yeah, should should have should have waited just a couple more seconds. I don't know. I mean, he would have dove us. Uh, yeah, I mean, we were just really too weak to take that fight, especially after they got um Dread. But it's fine. We should actually be able to get another, you know, move rather quickly. Um, I don't think I'm gonna be able to stop this though, unfortunately. Oh, I am. No, I'm not. D score shield. That's weird. I don't know how I didn't stop that. I guess he was already just like mid scoring animation. Who knows? Damn. 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 I like how my Ivysaur, after dominating this lane for so long, has decided that he just doesn't want to be here anymore. Uh, I gotta get rid of this Zard, man. I gotta get rid of him. I don't I don't want him in my stuff. I don't want him taking my stuff. It's my stuff. Go, go get your own. Go get your own stuff, Zard. Why? <laughs> can I can I get can I get a teammate up here, guys? Guys, can we can we can we maybe come to the top lane? There's there's literally nothing to fight for down there. They're literally just stealing our stuff. Oh man. The <sighs> I don't know why we're 4v2ing and losing bottom lane. Like, come on, guys. Come on. It's 4v2. How are we how are we how are we not dominating that lane? Alright, Talonflame decided to dominate the lane finally. I'm just gonna come in here and kill everything, because it's what I do. Lucari popped his Unite as well. So I completely wasted my time. Unfortunate. That was that could have been my highlight. That could have been my TikTok clip. Jeez, follow me on TikTok, by the way. Link as long as well, rather as all of my other social media in the description down below. Go uh, go follow me. I don't know why I tried to say as long as, but uh, it, that is also technically accurate. Uh, I guess I'll go to Dread. I guess I'll go to Dread. I don't really like going to Dread here because they're just going to get Rotom for free. Yeah, they got Rotom literally for free. Um, hmm. I just got to make sure we get this, dude. None of my teammates are helping the Absol with it either, and yeah, we just... Damn, they are... They outplayed the hell out of us there. Because my team is just doing nothing. Like, what is my Lucario doing? He was just sort of standing there menacingly. But not even really all that menacingly. He was just sort of standing there. Oh, Dreadnought was happening. Oh my god! I just melted. Yeah, Rotom is really good, dude. I don't know if you guys noticed, but Rotom, really good. And yeah, we have completely thrown any lead we had. Just completely thrown it. 
just by making you know questionable decisions like what are you doing down here what what are you, what are you doing down there you're just literally feeding just literally uh you know throwing I, I, don't, I don't know what you're doing down there bud it uh just seems questionable to me what's up Absol? i would have been a little bit heated had that gotten stolen from me but it didn't get stolen from me so it's fine i get to, i get to look like the hero in the kill feed and that's all that really matters looking like the hero in the kill feed i'm just farming because no one on my team is at least someone needs to be high leveled um guys can you just it's, it's one it's one charizard come on it's, it's it's one charizard let's 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 be let's be smart about this guys it's one guy there we go i think i can take this oh yeah we got that guy for sure gimme gimme don't worry boys i got you i got you it's not really my job to be getting all the ko's but i'm doing it i'll do what i can i do what i can you know all right we need to get this rotom or at the very least prevent them from getting rotom my whole team of course is rotating the dread which is honestly what i should be doing i should just be with my team but i want to i want to prevent them from getting rotom if anything like I, I think it's actually more important to prevent them from getting rotom than it is for us to even take it like genuinely i don't want them getting it good good play talon they're wasting all their stuff here which is good for good for us i have to unite here so i don't die i think dying here is even worse than um you know not having my unite so make sure we get this all right cool i really don't like using my unite move there but i, I think it was more important for me not to die and make sure we get that rotom no one's on zap right now if my lucario starts this i'm all in with him like we we should just start it yeah l l l let's just start it come on man Come on, guys. We're, 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 let's just start it. Let's just start it. There's, there's no one here. Let's just start it. <laughs> All right, there we go. Got him. Got him to start it. This should be free. This absolute. I don't think has his unite move. I'll push him, even if he does. Oh, he's done. He does have his unite move. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Mm. I don't know where the rest of my team was. Oh, they they died. How did? How does? What are you guys doing that you die there? Oh well. Oh well. <laughs> I don't I don't really understand what my Talon and Lucario were doing in that fight but I mean to each their own man play the game how you want to play the game like at the end of the day you, you just have fun playing the game your way and that's that's what really matters not not winning games or you know being smart or knowing how the video game works or you know being with your team fighting over the most important objective in the game make sure you have fun playing the game you want to that, that's that's what really matters in these competitive games guys that's what that's that's the real it's the real message i want to want to get across as long as you're having fun winning wins and losses just don't matter being being good at the game just doesn't matter <laughs> i'm so toxic man i'm gonna get i'm gonna get a dislike for that oh no okay Land that big freeze. I melted that guy. I absolutely just outplayed that Gardevoir. It's not gonna matter, of course, but eh. Oh well. It happens. Um, I I think this game really showed off how good this build is and how good Ninetales is now. So yeah, I can't really complain other than the fact that we completely lost and threw Dread or Zapdos. Like that's that's the only thing I can really complain about. I did my job. I felt like you know Ninetales showed off how good it can be after this new buff and how good this build is and how much fun i find this build like 13 ko's as a nine tails that's not supposed to happen like you're not supposed to be able to drop that kind of numbers as as a nine tails like that that's not what nine tails is supposed to do nine tails is just supposed to you know come in and really like assist on kills and like just not really clean up fights and you know be far and away the kill leader on a team that's not really what you're supposed to do with nine tails but sometimes it's what you have to do with nine tails and uh hey we uh we did stuff we did things uh I, I really like this build i really like nine tails i'm glad they um reverted the uh the supposed uh buff it got and made it actually a buff so i'm, I'm happy that it's actually good now that uh that is a very good thing so let's go ahead and see uh how much damage we ended up doing there uh yeah 80k <laughs> oh jeez, 38k as a as a Venu, 23k as an Ivysaur, 31 as a Lucario. The the the, the Talonflame did fine. 54k is not awful as a Talonflame, but 
Mm, I don't know, man. I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm just, I'm not saying, but I'm just saying. Uh, definitely popped off there a little bit. And uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you think of the new Nine Tails buff. Be sure to go follow me on all my stuff down below. And I will see you guys in the next one, probably with some Decidueye stuff. Bye.